barrel truck and today we are looking at Tandy large LCD pinball it was released in two different colours purple and green purple is by far the red one it was released by a couple of different companies as well but, um, as you can see this hasn't got a Tandy logo on but it's exactly the same machine why I'm calling it Tandy Pinball. Right, so we'll open up the box and see what happens. But as you can see, this is a purple version. And it was a light green one. You can see it's got a demo mode there. Decals are quite good. Depicting the pinball machine. We've got the on off button, start and the mode button. Game select and the flippers. You can see the actual screens. Similar to a lot of the pinball games you got. There was a few little mini LCD games released around the same time. Nearly identical screens. Top in this to how this works. So we press the mode button, set the game off, and press the add. Press the flipper to release the bar. Flippers to stop with like a general pinball game. You can see it's got excellent sound. And the lights light up when you do things on it. One of the better pinball games is. As many points as possible, like in a normal pinball mm -hmm. machine. There's areas of the pinball table, a bit more slow. It's game over. Right, so now we'll have it again, we'll have another game. Now we know what we're doing. To get in this top bit there, look where it's going round and round, and then you can all wrap up more points. There. Really good game, this actually. It's quite responsive. I'm not looking bad games, that is responsive. Let's see if have more time lag. You press the button, the ball does what you want, and the flippers go at the same time. Excellent, this. And that lights up as well. This is released in the 80s. It would have been amazing back then. It's actually one of the better pinball games I've seen like this. Let's see, it goes round and round at the top. game over again so look out for it so it was released by Tandy in the 80s it's usually in a green colour but um, it was also released with no actual branding and it was just called a big pinball this, this box came in a purple colour so I don't know if once Tandy went bust that they actually passed the licence up to the companies to yeah. use so it'll be interesting to find out anybody knows 
Anyway, so it's probably one of the better pinball games. Goes for about twenty pound, I think, normally on eBay. So if you're into pinball, pinball games, games, look out for it, and I'll put some more on. Anyway, like and subscribe, share the channel, and I'll see you next time, retro fans.